Hey guys, my name is Dan, I'm a veterinarian, and welcome to the video. Is your doggy licking their feet all the time? It's a really common problem, guys, and usually it can be as simple as an environmental allergy or some sort of skin or contact allergy, but feet licking, guys, it can be behavioral, but it really shouldn't be happening all the time. You shouldn't see staining of your dog's feet, which is gonna be that kind of that amber or brownish look to their fur. Excessive licking, guys, is usually irritation. And what kind of irritation is it? It's hard to say, but let's dive into this. Contact irritation from grass, environmental allergies are incredibly common during the spring and summer. When this happens, guys, you can get a lot of bacteria growth because bacteria is natural on the dog's skin. You can also get a lot of yeast. Yeast is a big culprit. If you're seeing a lot of licking, one thing you should really consider is clean your dog's paws off on a regular basis. I encourage people to clean the dog's paw on a daily basis, usually at nighttime, so when they go to bed, they have clean feet. Imagine if you walked around the grass all day and then you came inside and just went to bed. Like, that would be pretty gross. So what you should do is you should take some baby wipes or saline wipes and wipe the feet down to clean off excessive surface bacteria and yeast. By doing this, you're gonna have less bacteria and yeast in the dog's paw, which can lead to inflammation and irritation and infection in between the digits, the interdigital space. Now, of course, you may have some primary allergies, which may be managed with like antihistamines, or your vet may recommend uh, something stronger, like an, like an allergy shot. If you are noticing, though, that we're just really red and itchy, it is really important to clean the feet. Because by cleaning the feet, you can reduce the amount of infectious organisms on the feet. Now, another thing I like to do for the more serious cases is either doing like an oatmeal shampoo or a medicated shampoo with an anti-yeast or anti-fungal can be really helpful. And I'm, I'll try to have a couple linked below in the comment section for just some routine shampoos that are great that have anti-yeast and antimicrobial properties. But what I want you to do is get the feet wet and then scrub these shampoos between the feet in your digital space on the back of the foot on top of the pad and get it really cleaned up and let it sit for 10 minutes. Contact time is paramount when you're trying to kill yeast and bacteria. And then washing the feet clean of all the shampoo. Wash them really good, don't leave any shampoo behind. Doing this in conjunction with wiping the feet clean can be really helpful at removing surface organisms like yeast and bacteria. Usually I encourage people to wash the feet twice a week. If you wanna, if it's going really well, you cut back to once a week or every other week. But when you're in the real like peak of the season, you have a lot of itchy feet, washing them on a regular basis and wiping them daily can be really, really darn helpful to giving you a healthier doggy's skin or feet. Hi right, guys, hope that was crazy helpful. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. As always, my name's Dan, I'm a veterinarian. You guys take care, bye.